Data science in football. How Liverpool FC is using data science to dominate the footballing world. Football is known for being a sport that brings all types of emotions in a second. Football fans are known to be very aggressive people while they're watching a game as well as very sentimental people when their team either wins or loses. Teams like Real Madrid, Manchester United, Bayern Munich, Paris Saint-Germain, and Juventus keep making people visit their stadiums and buying their jerseys. But, what makes this sport so exciting? Football skills aren't all that it takes to win a match it seems. Data science also now plays a big part in the world of football, and it seems that Liverpool is leading the way in that field. After winning last year's UEFA Champions League final, the most important football competition in the world, Liverpool Football Club is now dominating its domestic Premier League, leading this season's standings by a whopping 25 points. What can explain Liverpool's extraordinary success? It's no secret that the club boasts some of the greatest football players in the world, but they're definitely not alone. Barcelona, Bayern, or Manchester City also have their fair share of amazing talent at their disposal. Liverpool's secret sauce might surprise many, data science. Most sports use a range of statistics to assess teams and players. Until recently, nobody in football cared about much beyond who scored the goals. Now we get updates on how many shots different players have taken, what percentage of the time each team has controlled the ball, and plenty of other metrics. But almost none of that seems to provide a clearer explanation of what's happening on the field, including which team ends up winning. For some time, the football club has been gathering exhaustive amounts of data and crunching the numbers in order to determine which players are most fitted to occupy a certain tactical position during certain matches, but also what's the best style of play. It's to some that the majority of football teams nowadays use science to improve their game. That said, a very small number of these in fact use their data to the extent that Liverpool does. Perhaps one of their advantages lies in the fact that the club's sporting director, Michael Edwards, is a former analyst. The club's famous manager, Jurgen Klopp is not only on board with the idea of incorporating science in his team's decisions, he's embracing it. The team even has a name for its new style of playing football augmented by science, pitch control. The name is self-explanatory, it's all about making the right, data-driven decisions such that the team can utilize the pitch to its full potential. Meanwhile, in the back end, there's an entire team of researchers and statisticians crunching the numbers so that Liverpool can bring out its best. For instance, Ian Graham, who is the director of the research division at Fenway Sports Group, the group that owns Liverpool FC, has a PhD in theoretical physics and is in charge of evaluating players and sporting trends data. Liverpool's data science team also includes Tim Waskett, an astrophysicist, and Will Spearman, who has a doctorate in philosophy, both of whom regularly appear publicly explaining pitch control. This graph is used as an example, control visualization that captures the regions of space controlled by certain players. The player circled in yellow has the ball, his team has access to areas of the pitch colored in blue, while areas colored in red are controlled by the opposing team. Pitch control theory says that the yellow circle has to pass the ball to a teammate positioned within the blue zone. According to Liverpool's outstanding team of data analysts, the team is combining event data and tracking data in order to analyze in real time how each action on the pitch impacts the probability of scoring a goal. This concept is illustrated in the graph. Pitch control constantly crunches the numbers to determine which areas of the field are most promising in order to score a goal. The red team is Liverpool and the areas in red are the places they can get to sooner than the players in blue. Everything is turned into a goal probability and this value, 1.3%, is the probability that a goal will be scored with the ball in this position within the next 15 seconds. Of course, Liverpool isn't the only football team to use data science. 
Most teams competing at the highest levels now have a data science department but, considering their performance, the Reds seem to be exploiting hidden trends and data better than anyone. More than other major clubs, Liverpool incorporates data analysis into the decisions it makes, from the corporate to the tactical. How much that has contributed to its recent performance is itself hard to measure. But whatever the outcome of the final, the club's ascent has already started to make number crunching acceptable, even fashionable, in England and beyond. What's certain is that the way football is being played has changed drastically, and we're only seeing the tip of the iceberg as technology will become increasingly incorporated into sports.